Hello you, welcome to Geekism. So this new one we've started seems to be, uh, the main problem here is that the atmosphere around it is particularly good at carrying germs and infections, so we can have epidemics amongst the patients, so we might have epidemics coming in uh, without us particularly politically doing anything. So uh, we've got a pretty big space to work with luckily, so I don't think we're going to have to spread out much quickly. So let's get started, let's get our, uh, our receptionist down first of all, before we do anything. And we'll have a right at the front here. And we must employ a receptionist. I know. Let's get rid of you. Uh, where are you? There you go. Okay, let's hopefully have a decent one. Oh, yeah, we have a very good one there. That's perfect. Off you go. Uh, where are you going? There you go. Good. And let's have a little bit of seating before we get up to our... We might as well start our buildings up here. So we'll have a little bit of seating here. Um... Just to just to kind of make use of this corridor is a little bit useless otherwise, really. Personally, there we go. Okay, so we'll get a GP up here. And I'm actually going to build, with the future in mind, I mean, there's not much, we're not going to get anything in there, so we might as well build a longer GP. I'm actually build, with the future in mind, I'm going to build a second GP to start off with here as well, because I've got a feeling uh, we're going to be here for a good while. So we want to be prepped for the future. There we go. Um, so we'll have GP there with his desk just behind, with his cup, what's it called? Cupboard behind him there. Um, and then we'll have there. So he's got a short way to go there to get to his cupboard. Uh, filing cupboard, that's the word. And the, the uh, patient's got a short way to go to get to their chair. So that's pretty good. Uh, we'll do a couple of radiators because I've noticed that the place is always pretty cold uh, whenever we build one. So. Let's try and build it so that we're a little warmer this time. Um, uh, can we get in there? Yeah, good. Okay. Any doctor? Let's get you going. Oh, we've got loads of doctors this time. Oh, and we have them all re-chained and stuff as well, which is great. So let's get a... Um, you're just a regular old GP. You can go there. That's good. Okay. Um, so we're going to leave that space for a second GP office. We'll probably build that a little bit later on. Uh, let's get some other diagnosis up on the go. So GD... He's open and ready to go, so we'll put that there. That's going to give us a three wide corridor that way if we carry on building, so that's perfect. And those at the front. Uh, there, screen towards the front as well, and then everything else we need. There we go, trying to sort of, you know, build on the issues we found in previous videos, so making sure that people run through nicely uh, and work quite well. Let's have a lot. You are such a good surgeon. We, I, I'm going to hire you and just put you in there for now in case you go off the list for some reason. Uh, also get the handyman on the way as well because um, that's you. Because the, we've now begun with the uh, plants. I can't think we were today. Um, I wonder if there's earthquakes in this one as well. I hope there's not because I hate earthquakes. Um, cardiogram is good. This is kind of like diagnosis alley. So let's get you there. That in a similar sort of position as the room next to it. And everything else here. Radiators and there. Plants and the bin out of the way there. I don't really know if the bins actually do anything. Um uh, go. And we've got that. We have oh so I can actually kill a bit of bigger, aren't you? So let's Let's stick a little pharmacy. No, there might be something better. Let's have a look. Facilities. Clinics. No. Diagnosis. Cardio GD. No, psychiatric. That's gonna be that's too tight a fit. I'm sorry. Just can't do it. I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll have that as the toilets. Because they are useful rooms. There we go. Can't do much with this space here. That's gonna have to be. Now that's going to have to be waiting space, we might as well give it something to wait for, so let's do pharmacy, that's going to be a busy one I think, especially if there's germs and stuff going around like it said. It's a little bit of a waste of the space, but I'm okay with it. A couple of radiators, let's get one, two, plants, uh, oh, plants and bin. Why are they popping up? I thought they I thought thought they stopped popping up after you've done it a few times. Uh, nurse, let's get a decent nurse. Got to be a good one. You there, fantastic. Thank you very much. Uh, okay, so that's sort of like our one strip of diagnosis, and then we'll have another one 
Uh, maybe on this side. What is that? Ah, is that? That's where the space opens up to. That's cool, isn't it? So it's all one building. Ah, neat. Okay, so that's probably where we'll work towards. Um, nine grand, seven, seven, and nine. Yeah, we'll we'll try and keep it all in one building if we can, uh, to start off with at least. So let's um let's get back to the rest of the diagnosis. Then we'll have a decent size psychiatric area. Um, that's about right. Got nice open spaces here. I think that's going to be quite important. Um, okay, so they're going to go. They only go there if they've got something like King Disease or whatever it's called. Uh, the one where they think they're Elvis. Uh, for instance, we should cover the radiator plant, bin, bookcase, and a skeleton. Uh, let's put these in a decent spot. I think they use these. I think, as in, like, he actually goes to them to get stuff. So we'll put them relatively near him. And then we'll have a nice plant there so it looks good. And that there, and fire extinguisher by the door. That's good. And let's get a psychiatrically, I don't know why I said it like that, trained uh, guy. There's a one there who's a surgeon and a psychiatrist, but he's awful. There's another one there who's a surgeon and psychiatrist who's awful. And there's one there who's a psychiatrist who's not quite as awful, so it'll have to be you, I'm afraid, Belt. Uh, welcome aboard. Uh, let's have a look. Operating theatre and ward, I'm not going to worry about just yet because I feel like they come a little bit later. So instead, let's get some other treatments on the go. Was there any other Was there any other diagnosis? Oh yeah, ward. Let's get a regular ward in. Have you got to go that way, have you? Okay, well, in that case, let's adjust this then. Um, let's build pharmacy next and we'll adjust this. It's going to be a bit weird now, but I think it'll work quite nicely. Um, clinics inflation here there we go just a little one that's good that'll probably be there and because that's a pretty easy building they walk in do their stuff and then go again somebody pointed out why do the walls have shadows even um does this build does this hospital have no roofs uh no i've never really thought about it before but i guess no they don't deal with it there we go uh, requires any doctor and ongoing ma maintenance. All the doctors are pretty weak. That one, you're pretty good. You've got surgery and research. So I'll have you. Uh, right, let's get this ward in. And I know I said I was going to build a GP here, but I'm not. I'm going to build a ward. And I know it's pretty near the entrance, but I think otherwise we're not going to get the best use of the space. Uh, right, so let's have the entrance this side, though. Like that. And let's have lots of windows in the ward, I think, for people sort of having a little nose in and seeing how their uh, beloved ones are getting on. I guess that's a thing that happens, is it? No, not really. Uh, desk there. Okay, so we can get a few more beds in. Let's squeeze the beds in first, and then we'll see about uh, having some space. Why can't you go there? Are you just a bit too close to you, are you? Okay. Um, there and there. Okay, four. That'll do. So we'll get rid of you. Being, no, no more desk. Uh, plants, a few radiators, fire extinguisher, good stuff. So plants up there be good. Fire extinguisher by the door. Um, radiator there and there. And the bin can go there for some reason. Okay, good. So nurse looks after the ward. You're pretty good. We'll drop you down there. Okay, good. So we've got a decent layout. A bit of a dead space here. So I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll make it look as though we're meant to have one. And we'll put some benches in there. And we'll sort some benches out at the top as well. So that's the middle row, unfortunately. So we can do... Um, two... It's, oh, no, no, it is, it's not a middle row. That's the middle row there. And we can do two the other side. Okay, that works out quite nicely. Looks like it's meant to be like that. And then up here, we'll do some. There we go. And we won't fill that because we need some drinks machines. Because they not only make us a little bit of profit, although I don't think it's much. We can't have one in there. Never mind, we'll have one there. Um, they also sort of help uh, with um, how thirsty people are and stuff like that. So let's have one there. No, one there. Yeah. Um, it's a bit random. One there. Actually, no, we won't have that one down there. I'll move that. Um, we'll have one. We'll have one there. Uh, we'll get rid of you. Yeah. Okay. That doesn't look like it's now sponsored by Kit Kat. 
Kit Kat the drink. Okay. So what have we now? We've, it's mostly facilities we need now. So it's things like staffing and uh, and everything else. So we've got a GP, we have a GD, we have a cardio, we have a psychiatric, and we have a ward. So we've got all the diagnosis. Uh, we also have psychiatric ward and pharmacy for treatment, but not the operating theatre yet. Uh, we have the inflation, and then we need yeah. So we need all of these basically. So first of all, we'll do a staff room up here, so it's out of the way. Um, out of the way a little at least because this will actually become a, a main sort of three way eventually but uh, for now at least it's it's out of the way we'll do that and we won't have a massive staff room we can always build a second one somewhere else if we need but we'll have a pool table and a video game and a TV and a plant and a couple of radiators but well, not another sofa I just don't think we're going to have the space for it so let's do it like this instead view there TV there yeah perfect and we'll have radiators where we can get them. Great. So there's one, two, three people can be in there at once and not really cause an issue. So that's great. Uh, facilities, we'll get some toilets in. Uh, and we'll carry these toilets down to there. And then that gives us one or two spaces for a couple more little clinics. So slack tongue and, um, and uh, bandages. I can't remember what the bandages one's called, but something like that, you know. Uh, we're not going to get much here, but I think we're going to be all right. I think it's going to be okay. I think we can deal with it. So let's do you and you there. And then we'll get loads of toilets and a few sinks. There we go. And you can't go that way. Never mind. Oh, in that case, actually, we need to shift the door. Let's go right back. Move the door to here. Yeah, that's better. There, 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 there. And another row. Okay, and then sinks along this wall. Okay, good. And then we can get rid of whatever's left and just put a couple of radiators in. Good to go. Toilet sorted. Okay, so we'll leave that open for either a GP or a couple of other um, clinics, whichever one comes first. Here, I, I, I can't imagine we're going to be able to stick anything in that space. Let's have a look. Um, like even the smallest ones, I mean, it makes a really thin corridor here, which I just don't like. So we'll have this as another waiting area that probably isn't actually going to be used that much. So, that's it. but it fills the space and it makes it look decent. And you know what? That's what I know a lot of you think this, this channel is about, is making things look good. Although it is, you know, so I'm happy to uh, stick to the stereotype uh, and we'll just, that'll do. I think, yeah, let's keep that like that. Okay, great. Let's get open. Uh, let's get sped up. Let's get some people actually in here and using the facilities. Um, everywhere staffed. So yeah, I think we're, we're rocking. We're ready to go. Ready to rock and roll. Let's see how we uh, get on. Somebody coming to be cured would be nice. Not much of a video otherwise. The icon that just popped up in the bottom left of the screen. Learn an important piece of... Why is, the, why is this showing? Three people with bloaty head. Yeah, let's go for it. We have an inflation clinic ready to go doctors sitting in there should have no problem with that we'll help on the rep look at that first patient cured was an emergency that's neat uh okay here we go three out of three 1500 quid awesome okay right well i think i'll just let it run for a little while because uh, there's not really much going on until some people actually get in here and we haven't got a research department so need a bit of money coming in get research done so we can start working on buildings to fill these gaps Okay, it turns out the uh, the um, surgery might actually be quite useful, the operating theatre, because I'm having a lot of people come in and go away. So uh, we're going to have to use the money up to carry on around here, I think, and build a surgery and a second ward. Uh, I think that's going to be the way we go around it here. Although, actually, we could just probably move this ward, I think. That's probably going to be a better idea. Uh, so let's get started on that. Uh, we need to buy the land first. I think we can afford the land and probably the buildings without a loan, I hope. 9850. Okay, we'll go for it. Yeah, I think I think this is gonna be doable. Um Okay, let's have a look. Facilities, no. Treatments, operating theatre. Uh no, balance, balance is too low. Eight grand. Whoa. Uh, okay, let's take a bit of a loan. We can manage a little loan. Uh which one's loans? Uh that one? No. That one, no, that one. Oh no, it's the money one, isn't it? Here you go. Bang. Uh let's take ten grand out as a loan. That should be enough. To sort us out, hopefully not put us into too much trouble. 
so operating theatre we're going to go down here I hope you fit yes you do perfect um, let's do let's come away four and then let's halve this so what's half of you six oh that's seven um, oh that's eight okay that'll do I was thinking we could build a little building on there for some reason like a little toilet or something um, it shouldn't be a problem. I have a little viewing platform there. So, um, you can go two ways. So, you can go there. We, we need to keep, keep you over here so you're out of the way. Oh, yeah, lots of stuff that goes on the wall here, isn't there? Let's go back then and get rid of those uh, windows because we're going to need your wall space, I'm afraid. There, there, and you can go there. Good. So, I think we just want radiators and a fire extinguisher here because it's not the sort of place you would have plants. It's a pretty big room, so we're going to have three radiators. There we go. So now we have an operating theatre. Now I'm pretty sure um, we are exhausted our diagnosis procedures. Go home until we get a research department. There's no point in you hanging around because we've got no more research. Um, so that's that. Yeah, and I think what we'll probably do eventually. So let's move this ward over. Hopefully, it won't cost us that much. I'm not too sure if we'll actually get any money back. Let's try. Seven grand. Yeah, we got a bit, a little bit back, but I do think it's going to be more beneficial to have this over by the uh, the operating theatre. Um, let's just have a big ward. Let's just go for it. Ward there. A little bit of a viewing platform again. Not viewing platform, you know what I mean. Um, so if you can we get two there? No, it's a bit close to the window. One and that, and then a few more. I think three, three more will get in probably. One, two. Can we squeeze one in there? Three. Yeah, that's good. And then a bin, a plant, a couple of radiators, and a fire extinguisher. The classic setup. <laughs> It has now become classic anyway after this series. Uh, plant somewhere that we can see it. I like to be able to see the plants. There we go. And the bin, you can just go out of the way. Not too fussed about you. Um, up there. Good. Okay, so nurse. Oh, look, we have a disease. So let's get. Um, let's hire another handyman. We've, only, we've got one at the minute, but we could probably do with maybe even a second. And we'll have one guy just for sweeping up. Yeah, because we've got it down the front here as well. So you, your job is just sweeping up. That's all you do, buddy. All right. King Complex, uh, go home. Senpai Show. I know what's up with him. That's what's annoying. It says we don't know what's up with them, but I know, I know, I know what's up with you. Okay, nurse is there. Uh, okay, good. So what's this? Classic situation comedy. That's a psychiatrist. We can sort it. Uh, golf stones. Um... We must build a ward. Yeah, we can do that now. He's already gone in, I think. That was him over there. Handyman Central, this place. But I think we're going to have to deal with that. So, let's uh, let's have a look about research. How much is research going to cost? Five grand. Can we get you into here? Yeah, we can. Let's let's build it. Because we're not going to get much further without it. I know it's expensive. But it really is the sort of thing that we need to get into place. Um, can we fit you there? Yes. And we leave that open to add a second desk at some point. Radiator, plant, and bin. Uh, actually, we might as well just put the desk in now. We've got the money. Oh, maybe not. Oh, that's annoying. I just thought you'd fit there, pal. Um, let's move you there. Does that do it? Yeah. Okay. Um, there. Radiator. Ooh, we're struggling here. It's a bit of a squeeze. We'll go without the bin. I personally think the plant is more important. There we go. Okay. Oh, now we've got uh, a bit of an issue now. We need to slow the time down a bit. We've got no benches over here. Like an idiot. I've not put any benches. So we've got people standing up. I'll put you there and there and there. 
and there and there and there and there okay oh because that perfect timing uh have we got another surgeon coming over looks like we have awesome so we've got two surgeons going into surgery is now operational let's get another uh, doctor hmm. where's this single doctor with research do we have do we have one with research and something else yeah surgery and research that's annoying um okay let's um let's hire you see if that's giving oh we're missing uh missing stuff down here um what a storming hospital grace happy to see that you're not happy you can have a raise he's just cleaning up sick all day i wouldn't imagine i imagine you are um send home until we're doing some research we can't really do much um hire you i think you can because you can hire them and f like maybe then fire them oops no i didn't want to do that there we go yeah 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 uh no still only give us a six so we're just getting rid of our options here unfortunately so we'll leave it for now see if another month goes we'll get some more um the only researcher we've got is in here so once he's done yeah they're hanging around now so the one we've researched, you can go into here. Thank you. And you get started on something. Let's figure out what we want. We don't want improvements. We don't want drug research. And we don't want specialization. We do want cure equipment. And diagnosis equipment. So we'll get those working first. Good stuff. I think apart from that, we're doing pretty all right. I think we've got all the buildings we need. We haven't got training yet. I'm not too worried about that just now. Um, go home until we've got some more diagnosis. There's not really much we can do. Uh, inflation sorted. Toilets are sorted. Research is now built. Staff room is now built. Although I may end up just in this a little. But actually, so far, it's not too bad. Let's get some uh, radiators. Just going to fill these uh, areas here because it has a ha people have a habit of getting very cold so we'll just drop them down until we build them out okay cool so again we'll let it run we'll see if we can get some of this debt paid off and there uh, and we'll just come back and uh, sign off in a couple of minutes i think so here's the thing uh, your doctors have discovered a contagious strain of sleeping illness if you declare an epidemic you pay a fine of four grand take a reputation hit and all your patients will be vaccinated immediately automatically however if you attempt to cover up you have a limited time to cure all infected patients before the health authorities find out if a health inspector does visit and finds an epidemic cover up in progress you can take uh, they can take drastic action against you declare an epidemic pay the fine and take the reputation hit or uh, attempt to cure all the places I'm, I've just saved actually just so happens so I'm going to attempt to cure and I hope it uh, it doesn't go horrific so it looks like these uh, these folks here are the ones with uh, with the problem so I'm going to get a screenshot of them first of all a lot of people there's not much we can do about them uh, send the patient home so we get some more stuff research which we're working on a uh, new condition, a uh, high dose of powerful stimulants is delivered by the nurse. Great. Okay, so research. Yes, come on. Go and do some work, please. Thank you. Uh, so if we get these healed, I guess. There was two people with it. Well, so here's one. Yeah, she's getting. he's getting cured. And here's the other one. Get Forget your drink. Go and get cured. You, you're ill. Hurry up. Okay, I think that's it. Did she just appear from somewhere? Nurse can be in the ward. Weirdo. Uh, I think I think that's it. New slicer. Uh, when the time expires or a contagious patient leaves your hospital, a health inspector will visit. The button toggles to vaccinate mode on or off. Click on a patient to get them vaccinated by a nurse. Oh. Should, should I have done something then? Have I gone wrong? Have I? You can talk to me. Have I gone wrong? Should I have vaccinated them? But they've been cured and they've left, so is that bad? Oh, okay. That's fine. And click that button and then click on them. Ah, uh, okay. But they've been cured and they've left, so that's fine. 
Uh, okay. It's all right. Nicholas held me out there. Fractured Bones um, sends the research department. Sends the research department. Thank you. Oh, you're going to uh, donate your body to science. Thank you. Uh, right. So there we go. So next time we have to try and vaccinate them. Well, what, so so you vaccinate them if you don't think you can cure them in time. Oh. So they get sun. Oh, right. Okay. And get them dealt with before the authorities come. Right, okay. I'm only repeating what you say because I don't think you'll be picked up on the mic. Okay, cool. So, luckily that was only two people, so I just feel like we've we've done it in time. So that's not too bad. Okay, our GP needs to go for a little chill out, but he's not. He's rocking and rolling, he's keeping going, he's getting tired, there he goes. Uh, another one's come in to step in. New x-ray has been researched, fantastic. And we've got a little bit of money, we paid the, paid the, uh, the loan off, by the way, while we were running through. So we'll uh, we'll probably look at building that X-ray because oh, slack tongue is done as well. We definitely need to do that. Let's um, let's get that in because that's an that's an easy uh, easy money maker. That one is. Um, let's just show you down here. Uh, oh, wrong one. Treatment clinics. There we go. Slack tongue, and we should be able to get one more in there. The fractured bones one. That'd be perfect actually if we could fit that in there. Uh, these little clinics go in quite nicely. In here. Oops, that was just the one plant. And there. 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 Plant at the back. Been out of the way. Bush. I won't hire a doctor for that because they're few and far between. So we now have. Um, send home. That's annoying. We haven't discovered Slat Tong. We've sourced all the dyes I've seen. 78% of fractured bones. We have we can't fix fractured bones at the minute anyway. Okay, so that's fine. Um, let's build. What's the other thing we've got? Treatment. Diagnosis. X-ray. Oh, it's really out of the way for diagnosis. Can we get it down here? Let's see if we can do that. Diagnosis. I know we said that we were going to have a, a GP there, but we need the we need the diagnosis machines at the moment. So that's what's really doing us in. Uh, so I'll have you Let me think what's best we could go there. No I'll Have you out of the way because the x-ray machine is one of these really bulky ones. that's really hard to fit in Let's Try you there and Yeah, x-ray is really tricky one to fit in place. Let's um Let's go far back and drag you out a bit because you that can be dragged out to like oops really like there without it being a major issue it's a bit awkward there but it's okay I can deal with it um, but let's have the entrance up here let's keep this through put way a little bit less oh he's got a bit of transparency look poor guy uh, you can go there you can go there yeah it's just a, it's a huge space but you know they normally are in real life actually the, the, the these sort of things are quite a big big buildings big rooms uh, x-ray requires re any doctor there we go oh and we do have earthquakes as well I can't remember if they were they were shown on camera but uh, we do have earthquakes so we've got to keep an eye on our uh, thingies as well oh research and psychiatry you'll do get you in there You should now go and get an x-ray done, I think. Uh, but you're not, oh yeah, you're just hanging around. Can I send you somewhere? Hmm. We'll see. Spent a bit of money on that, but that's okay, I think. So we'll keep working on research, hopefully. Are you on the way to research? No, you're going, you're just hanging out. Oh no, you're going down to surgery, that's good. What about you? No, your surgery as well. What's the emergency? We'll finish off with an emergency. 12 people with gut rot. No, we can't do it. I think we did. We had that before and we managed eight. I'd rather just not kill people. Um, 
go home. Right, I think we'll have to leave it there. Thank you so much for watching. We'll carry on with this episode, uh, carry on with this hospital even in the next episode. Uh, thanks very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, please give us a like. It really does help out the channel. If you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. And um, any thoughts, comments, or queries, pop them down in the comments below. If you fancy chat, you can find me on Twitter. I'm at Johnny Sparrow. A health inspector has heard rumours of your institution was dealing with a case of sleeping illness. However, has not been managed to find anything. And we've been given conversation. Huzzah. Oh, wicked. Uh, yeah, and if you want to join in with the Geekism community, you can find us on Discord. The link is in the description of this video. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.